there's like you want to be stoic okay but All right, overzealous Berniak. We're going to uh, go down south. We meet up with Chris and uh, get this car going. Uh, we got the jets in, so let's go. And we're back. <laughs> this was, here's the new jets. New Amazon. good to run lean versus rich so I'm gonna go ahead and bump it up to a 42 hopefully that gets it running rich and then kind of try to back it out back it down this is the main jet on the top this is the pilot jet inside here I had a crotch rocket that, uh, that these used to come loose because I wouldn't snug it maybe too much because I ended up breaking the flow too because I just didn't go too much. So now it's still snug. Yeah, so I was wondering, these pink hoses are, are 
your tubes. gas goes into here and fills up this bottom chamber and when the gas goes in the air is going to get some gas so with these tubes. Now you can hear the uh, carburetor filling up with gas. You can hear the tube sucking up air, They're pushing out air. And something is done. So let's try to start her up. Basically, what we're looking for is this is going to be yellow, is going to be lean, green is going to be stoic and red is going to be rich. Pretty sure. We want to be in the green. Still lean. Uh, let me get bigger jets. Yeah, for the sake of not running lean, because I want to run rich and rich and go make my way down. Because rich is safe, safer. Oh, it doesn't. Didn't that kick go to like hundred or something? Yeah, Um, shout out to people with uh, mental health issues. Um, I was actually diagnosed with schizoaffective disorder a few years ago, and I have a full time job. I have, you know, I pay. pay you gotta, and all kinds of shit, and all kinds of toy cars, and motorcycles, and all that. So, if I can do it, you can. And I was pretty bad. I'm talking hearing things and <laughs> all kinds of shit. But, stay on your medication, keep going to the doctor, go to a plan, keep working on yourself.
Well, so says me, folks. <laughs> Take her back in, figure it out, yeah. I mean, would changing the main jet do anything or no? Because you already got a good um, main jet? Well, we can change the main jet, and we can also mess with the main jet. So we can do two things, but really... Yeah, my bad. I was looking. I was looking. Yeah, check the well, corners. This, this, I'm doing... I'm going to spray some car cleaner in it to try to get it to, to run a little bit richer. See what happens. <laughs> hey, 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 look, if it's a terrible idea, let us know in the comments. So we're not getting any type of normal readings on the uh, air flow ratio gauge. We're getting still getting 10, but the idle is... It's dying, it's stalling, and it's puffing out black smoke. So that's an indicator of it running rich. So we're gonna go ahead and go down to a 48. See how it runs then? But, I mean, this one started up nice though in the beginning. That was weird. Now it's like everyone wants to see. Oh, yeah. smoke every other puff but then you started like getting a nice tame on it wasn't blowing any more black smoke but I mean I would I could say is maybe go down you know just from reading that go down one more maybe okay let's let's raise the needle Yeah, let's raise the needle a little bit and see what that does. Needle's in the top. Turn this off. you guys how to take this apart but I got these springs in here loaded pretty good it's gonna be hard to uh, put it back together it always is
back. Very hard because they're doubled up. Okay. Now, inside there. You want to push this up, push the needle up. Oops. You got that? Can you grab that thing? Same size needle. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay, so. If you see, there's a clip on the needle right here, and there's different adjustments to adjust the needle in and out. And so we're gonna we're gonna put it in the middle. Why did that one go through so easily? Well, let's make sure that we've got a little bit of play in the in the uh, rod right here, and a little bit of play is still not going up. That's good. That's perfect. Make sure it closes all the way. And unfortunately, with the spring in there, as you can see, it doesn't. Uh, it doesn't. The throttle doesn't open up all the way. That's about as far as the throttle opens with the double spring. So that's something I'm going to have to address in the future, but to make it idle and cruise around, should be alright. Let's open it up, 
see what main jet is in the old one. See what main jet is in this one. Compare. 128 was in the old one. What is this pack? The pack that we brought goes up to like 140, yeah. You don't have to take out the uh, whole bottom to take the main jet out. You can just take it out like this. That's pretty cool. 122. All right, this main jet is a little small. That was in there. If, uh, we had a 128 in there and it was running well. Major should go up. Um, there's a 128 in the last one. Let's put a 128 in this one. The last one, you said that was a 122. No, the 122 was in, that was in this one. one. Gotcha. Yeah. Sure, the gas is on. This, unfortunately, folks, is what you have to go through when you're customizing shit.
Yeah, yeah. What it used to sound like. So what do you think? I don't know. So now go the small one, go down one more then? Yeah, do it. Because it's it actually starting to sound like, yeah, like you said, when dude gave it to you, it's starting to sound like that again. That uh that crisp sound, yeah. So you want to stay there? Or you want to uh, do You want to go one down one more? Yeah. That's a good question. I'd say, me, honestly, I'd say go down one more. It sounds like it's, she's got a little bit of a little putt-putt towards the back end when you were down further away. But, yeah, it did look like, you know. But you're going to have to, like I said, you're going to have to overall, you ride it every day. You're going to know more than me. So up to you. I mean, we got time. We can just run that. We'll do it one more, you know, if you want to put it in, or just let it ride and then, you know, ride it on a. Let's see. Should have brought that light with me. Hold on. Let me see if you got some up here too. Uh, it does seem to be running really, like, uh, really pretty good. Um, if you come over here and look at the sensor, um, while I was 
rolling the throttle, about quarter throttle, it was reading about 14, maybe a little bit less, between 13 and 14, which is pretty good. Um, so I think I'm gonna leave it how it is right now and ride it around, see what kind of gas mileage I get out of it. But yeah, uh, see what kind of gas mileage I get out of it, and uh, we'll go from there. Go from there, yeah, for sure. All right, bet. So, yeah, we got a 40, decent day, but yeah, it sounds a hell of a lot better from when we started. In. We're not getting any black smoke, none at all, yeah. we can tell. Yeah, true. Yeah, because um, it is better. Later on, maybe I can, I'll see. But if I do get any more black smoke, I'm going to lean out. Yeah, we'll, we'll do another, yeah, we'll do another video. More. Go down in the jet. Um, now, I might be getting a lean reading on idle because of this being an open pipe right here. And O2 sensor is supposed to be a little bit away from the opening. But I'm not positive. I'm no expert. <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna leave it at that. Um, I say it was successful. Yeah. In video here, man. Yeah, I say it's definitely successful. It sounds like that. Yeah, a lot better. If he wrote a lot better, he sounded a lot cleaner when you were going around the block too. So I like it. I like it. Yeah, it definitely had, is more responsive. So but yeah, guys. We'll end it here and. Uh, Oh yeah, we'll see you on the next video.